Hey everybody, welcome back to another reaction video. Hope you're doing well. My name is Todd. This is Xena and Gabriel. A tribute to when fates collide from Xena Warrior Princess. You're going to notice a little difference in the audio quality and the lighting. Temporary, thankfully. But uh, this is some of the earliest stuff I used. The lighting was just really cheap. But the, uh, the microphone would was also cheap. <laughs> it was the first microphone I ever used on this channel. I've actually placed an order to get some duplicates of what I have at home so the quality doesn't dip as much when I'm traveling or out of the house. So I appreciate your patience with that. Let's go ahead and get started. It's been a while since I've watched anything Xena related. I saw the way you looked at her tonight during the play. Caesar give anything to have you look at him that way. It's what we all dream about, isn't it? Someone that looks so deeply into our soul that it finds something worth dying for. I really believe that kind of love exists. Maybe. <laughs> Possibly. What do you want? You're in my way, Zena. And it's time I did something about it. Don't Damn. Don't me again. Whatever happens, know that my love for you is endless. <gasps> Those images, they're not from this life. There's something more. You showed Zena visions of your former life. Caesar changed our fate, giving us this godforsaken world. I can't let you die. Some Wait a minute, he, Caesar time. looks really familiar. Is that what your play was about? Be prepared to sacrifice all for love. For love. You don't want to fight worse than death. I'm dying before you get a chance to know who you really are. No! Caesar, Rome. Is that Cal Urban? Is that who that is? I can't figure it out, but it looks like him. Like a really young version of him. Everything happens precisely as it should. They went through some things, didn't they? <laughs> Link down below in the description for the original edit. Go throw it some love. Does that level of love exist? Boy, that's an existential question, isn't it? <laughs> some of us would say yes. Some of us would say no. I guess it just depends on your life path. I would argue there's more than enough examples of it being the case, whether it be in history or in your own life or somebody else's life that you're close to. It, uh, there's a lot of examples of that. There's no doubt about it, even from just watching these edits and not actually seeing much of the show. Again, if you haven't seen the other videos I've reacted to about Xena, I've seen maybe bits and pieces of the series throughout the years, which I was extremely young when this show came on, I believe. So I don't exactly have a lot of context with it. You know, it's kind of like one of those shows that you see decades ago and you're like, oh yeah, I remember the characters or some of the characters <laughs> I can I can pick them out of a lineup I just can't you know tell you anything about the plot or what actually happened during that show but I I know of it it's pretty obvious Xena and Gabrielle have been through a lot clearly they have a very close friendship I don't know exactly how far it goes but I think it's mostly just wishful thinking a part of these uh edits maybe it would be something else if you know it was made at a different time not exactly sure. I think I've forgotten about how much brutality is in that show. You know, I, I don't remember much of it, but I do remember obviously some action 
you're gonna get action. As you know. I mean, she is literally the warrior princess, but uh, I think what I remember most about those shows, like Hercules and Xena, is it very much had that 90s TV violence, which was very subdued, you know, pretty, pretty strict guidelines for them. Like it couldn't be too bloody, couldn't be too gory or anything. But there's a level of brutality in that that I don't remember seeing, so maybe it was a little worse than I thought. Let me know your thoughts down below in the comments. Thanks so much for watching. I appreciate it. I will see you on the next one. Take care of yourselves. Bye-bye.